Hi, I'm Stacy White, and this is All Things Online Video. So I want to continue the discussion about digital cameras with uh, a little bit of a history of the cameras that I've chosen to use in my, with my online videos. So I started off with the Flip Ultra. You probably remember that little, it was a white camera or a black camera, and it, it was the first low quality point and shoot digital camera, um, HD quality digital camera. The problem was it didn't have an external microphone. So I got rid of that. And then I replaced it with the Kodak ZI8. Now the Kodak ZI8 is no longer manufactured by Kodak. So, but if you have one, use that. If you want to use a Kodak brand, look for one that shoots HD quality video and allows you to connect an external microphone. If it does, you're golden. But then I, I, I like that camera and I still use it as a backup camera. But I found that I always had to have the camera with me, and I always had my iPhone with me. So I started shooting videos using my iPhone. My iPhone allows me to plug in a external microphone, and it shoots HD quality video. So I was OK. But then the problem with that was, and so for those of you who are consider using this, take heed. You have to remember to turn all your gizmos and wizards and bells and whistles and reminders off, because in the middle of your shoot, your phone will, being helpful, will remind you of something, and you're going to have to reshoot. So wanting to keep it simple, I decided to move to another Apple product, the Apple iPod Touch, fifth generation. And that's the camera I'm using right now to shoot the, this video. And I use this camera for most of my videos, actually. So it shoots 720p and 1080p digital uh, high definition video and allows me to plug in my external microphone and it's very easy to use and it makes it very simple for me to use my Apple iMovie software and Final Cut Pro software to do the editing of the video even right on the phone. So that's what I've chosen to do. Then I decided I wanted to get a fancy camera and I went and I got a Canon Vixia, um, the mid-range of the, of the Canon series. And I like that camera, it allows me to zoom. So if I need to zoom, I use that camera. But the point is, I keep it simple, and I make sure that I meet my own two requirements, HD quality video and external microphone. So that's my camera journey. I don't have a DSLR. I don't know that I'm gonna go out and buy one. I'm doing a really good job with what I have already. Oh, and one more thing. If you want to learn how to make your own online videos, then be sure to download my free report, How to Make Quick, Easy, and Affordable Videos. You can get there by clicking the link below this video or visiting the link at the end of this video.